What's going on YouTube? Justin right here. So in today's video we're discussing about the A12 jailbreak for the iOS 12.4 and of course lower 12.1.3, 12.1.4 and so on. And we're discussing about what's currently going on, what we should expect and when we should expect this jailbreak. Well, you probably know that it has been updated in here on the official website and this manual progress bar in here has been increased a bit. but a lot of people ask me what's currently going on because the development seems to be halted and it seems to take forever for the jailbreak to be released. Well, yesterday Pound to Own posted, quote, the progress has been updated at uncover.dev. Everything is mainly done now, including tweak injection, except for a bug which breaks certain applications and causes stability issues. No ATA, but it's almost done. So for those of you who are wondering, yes, it takes more time for the uh, A12 jailbreak to be released. And that is because the A12 devices are a little bit different compared to the normal ones. There is the PAC, which is the point authentication codes, which we discussed and Pound Own was trying to bypass. And then of course he had a complete shift in his paradigm of jailbreaking and he tried to do something without a PAC bypass, which of course worked out great because as you can see, everything is mainly done as he says in here, but there are still some bugs that have to be fixed. And the fixing is actually quite hard because there is really no research that has been published by other jailbreak teams into the public domain. And yes, the Chimera team did indeed jailbreak the iOS 12.2 on the A12 devices, but their jailbreak was not open source and their techniques are not open source. And of course, the bugs they run into and the solutions they found for these bugs were of course not published. So the Uncovered team has to do a lot of work in order to basically find what's currently going on, what the bugs are about, and of course how to fix them. But for the moment, the iOS 12.4 is still signed. So if you want a jailbreak for the A12 devices, it's definitely advised to update the iOS 12.4 at this point. And you're probably going to ask me, what about what Pond said just a few weeks ago about staying on iOS 12.1.4 and so on? Yes, initially the idea was to stay on iOS 12.1.4 or 12.1.3 because for these versions there was a PAC bypass and there were more chances for a jailbreak to come on these versions on A12. But since Pound to Own managed to create a solution that doesn't even require a PAC bypass, updating to iOS 12.4 is a better idea while it's still signed. Now remember that the iOS 12.4.1 does patch the bug used in the uncovered jailbreak, so if you're planning to jailbreak you should definitely update iOS 12.4 while it's still signed. It may probably not stay signed for so long. Also, you should definitely save your blobs as well. And I made a video yesterday on how to do that. Now for those of you waiting for the uncovered jailbreak to be released, you can always stay updated here on the website. Currently there is full rootfs integration and you can read and write from the rootfs because it's being remounted as read and write which is actually quite good on the A12 and as Pawn said in here, tweak injection actually works. So he did get everything working with one single exception and that bug has to be fixed before the application is released. But of course the uncover for the A12 devices is mostly done and soon you will be able to install tweaks on your A12 device which are currently at the time I'm making this video the latest Apple devices. Of course this will change in a few days when the Apple event comes but of course for the moment these are the latest and greatest and I'm sure that you will be happy to jailbreak them very very soon. Now as I said this bug is an important bug and has to be fixed because it affects the stability but once Pawn fixes that he will be able to release the uh, binary, the IPA file and you would be able to jailbreak. So yeah everything that was hard to do and of course hard to implement is actually already done. At this point it's just bug fixes and stability improvements so that he doesn't get any reports of devices that cannot be jailbroken on A12. So yeah, thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe to stay updated, update iOS 12.4 while you still can and as for the A12 jailbreak it definitely comes soon, just a little bit more patience. Thank you for watching again, I'm Geosnow and peace out.